Evolving Skies is finally here. A set that I promised you I would make a little bit of a comeback for. I missed out battle styles. I've done very, very little chilling rain because I couldn't afford it. But now, here I am. Evolving Skies, booster box. Not the whole thing in one video because definitely can't afford it. But I'm gonna split the box four ways or at least try to split it four ways. We'll see how it goes, but I want to thank whatscards.co.uk for hooking me up with this boost box, so a massive shout out to them. Link in the description down below for their website where you can order your Evolving Skies and pre-order upcoming sets as and when they obviously go on pre-order. I've really been looking forward to this set. The Evolutions just look absolutely amazing. Rayquaza, also amazing. There are so many different alt arts and fancy arts and art. It, it, beautiful, beautiful cards. I've been so eager to get into this box. I knew it was turning up today. I was working and I was just waiting for work to finish so I could come home and crack into this booster box. So let's get into it and see what goodies are inside. Have a look at those pack arts. Oh. Smells like expensive cardboard. Alrighty. Another box to add to the collection of empty booster boxes that I have larking around. So there we go, I've got Ray on the front there. Umbreon on the side, Sylveon on the other side, and we have the uh, VMAX Duraludon for the other artwork. So, we always, in the past, when I've opened up booster boxes, have gone for the left hand side. So, that's what we're going to do. Let's go with two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight. And that leaves us with what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, it leaves us with ten on the other side. Well, that's not quite even, is it? So we've got we've got two artworks. Yeah, one, two. All right then, because this is the opening of a new box, we'll do three lots of artworks and save the other booster packs. For future videos because you know I've got to make this uh, got to make this stuff last so that's not quite an art set we are missing the ray which is in the box still there we go so there's one art set two art sets three art sets oh. keen eager excited to get on with this we'll start off of course with a Rayquaza pack if I can get it open that would be grande alrighty First pack of Evolving Skies. We've got a Shopping Centre Trainer card. I'm going to take a moment on some of these cards just to appreciate the artwork because obviously we haven't really seen them yet unless you've watched other videos, other channels with uh, the other YouTubers, PokeTubers, who managed to get their hands on the pre release stuff. we got a Dwebble. We've got Mareep. That Drowsy. That's pretty cool. There we go, swap that a little bit closer for you. The lighting, unfortunately, is not too great today. We got Scraggy. Got a Rapid Strike Feebas. And another Rapid Strike Feebas for the reverse. And our first pack is a Holofoil Zoroark. A beautiful card. Do love a Zoroark. All right, so not bad for a first pack. We got a Hollow. I'm I'm not going to shun at the fact that we managed to get a Hollow. 
We'll move on now to the Sylveon pack. Dark Energy. Snow Leaf Badge. Okay. Yeah. Hippodon. Bravery. Love Disc. Webble. Hippie Pop Pop Anonymous. Zora, which I believe is the pre evolution of Zoroark that we just pulled in that last pack. Sigh. What the hell is going on? Twice in a row we pulled the card and then the opposite for the uh, reverse. I mean, I'm not complaining, but. And then a Gigalith, looking very awesome. But a non holographic. Alrighty. On to the next pack. Umbreon. Hopefully, we will put at least one of the Evolution cards, one of the V cards, in one of these packs. I'll no, any, any of them would be nice. But of course, the chase card that we're after is the full alternate art Rayquaza. That is the card. Rescue carry with a crossle just before it. We got the Crystal Cave, Hitmonchan, Single Strike, Slackoth hanging from a cliff. Petalil, hey, there he is, the main man himself, the Pikachu. We got a Pump Kaboo, uh, Floet as the reverse, and a Stoutland, non holographic. Okay, moving on to this Duraladon V Max pack to complete our first artwork set of packs. Only got one hollow so far. Lightning energy. Lombre. A lucky ice pop. I'm not sure what makes it lucky, but okay. We got Scrafty. We got Shora. We got Tentacu. We got Dino. Oh, we're bringing back the dragon type cards, are we? Okay. Okay. We got a lightning. <laughs> A lightning? What am I about? We got a Mareep. I'm looking at the types now. That, uh, that Dano Dragon type really caught me off guard. Yeah, we got a Wobbuffet. Shopping Center Reverse. And what do we have here? A Garbador V. Okay, so we finally pulled a V card. Within the first four packs, I would say. Certified win. All right, Sylveon. On to the second pack art set, whatever you want to call it. One, two, three, four. Have seen a lot of people posting misprints that they've been pulling out of these cards, where it's just been like completely miscut, or like the outline layer has been completely shifted, and all the colours are all over the place. It, it looks pretty cool. Um, I hope I don't pull one because I don't particularly want any missed cuts, but yeah, you know what? If it happens, it happens. Got a low tad reverse and a. Oh, yes, mate! That is one of the ones I wanted. A Galarian Articuno. Obviously, missed out on the ones from Chilling Rain with the full arts and the alt arts, but you know what? I'm happy with just a plain old hollow Galarian Articuno. Fun fact, I actually caught one, or the one, in my Nintendo Switch game last night. After chasing it halfway around the map in the Crown Tundra. Just got the Zapdos to go, I got the Moltres. That dark fiery bird that looks so cool. Fighting Energy, Fletchinder, Lucky Ice Pop, Tentacruel, Bergmite, Drowsy, Scraggy, a Bagon, another Dragon type. We got that Wubat, Pyro, okay. 
that's a legendary technically. And Ampharos looking very, very cute indeed. Kill! Cool. Pulling some pretty awesome cards, my guys and girls. On to this next pack. Ah, there we go. Two, three, four. Just notice that big white line down the side of what would will be our reverse hollow when we get there. Lightning energy, we got Avalug, G -g 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 -g. Ribbon Badge, Azvelios, again, Dragon types making a comeback. Bergmite, a uh, Rock and Roller or Rog and Roller. Swablu, incredibly cute card. Lit Leo, Chinchow, Shellgon, again, rolling without Dragon type. And a Pincer. I just want to have another look over the shell gone because of the uh, big white line going down the side of the card there. I don't know if you can really see it. Just uh, incredibly, incredibly bad cut quality. And I know I said on that last pack the pyro being a legendary. I've just realised it's not the legendary. It was Solgaleo. That was a legendary, not. Pyrol. Pyrol was the evolution of the Litleo, which we've just pulled in that pack, and that's what reminded me, so, uh, yeah. Silly me. Two, three, four. No Amazing Rares in this collection, I don't believe. I haven't seen anything about Amazing Rares for this set. Palpatude, Shopping Center, Herdier, Timple, Eevee, there it is with that. You see him? Oh, excuse the black thumb as well. I um, shut my thumb in a, in a door. There we go. Rayquaza at the top of that EV card. We got Applin. Big man himself, Pikachu. We got a cute fly. Rog and Roller for the reverse. And an Appleton. Dragon type. Kind of nice to see the Dragon types making a return, I think. They got rid of them because it wasn't part of the. Uh, the build for competitive play and obviously they've uh, bought it back so it is alrighty last card for oh no no that that last pack was the last one for that art set that previous art set we're on to our final art set now and another white line down the side of that reverse hollow that we've got in this slot but ice Q skip loom Elemental Badge, Drowsy, Scraggy, Phoebes, Hitmonchan, Slackoth, Wobbuffet as the reverse, and Tropius going for a fly as a non holo. So only one V card so far. It would appear that the pull rates in this set are going to be just as trash as the previous two sets, which is why I avoided them. Say goodbye to my bank account. One thing I haven't actually looked at, and it probably would have been a good shout, was how many cards are in this set. 203. So, quite a big-ish set, really. Hedia. Pyro. Dream Ball. Nicket. The Webble. Rufflet. Rog and Roller. Wabafet. Fletchling as the reverse. And Smeagol. Dragon's tail, leaving that strip of paint behind him as our non holographic rare. Alright, alright, alright. Two packs left, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, we got a Umbreon, which I'm saving till last. And we got this Venex Duraladon Skyscraper. Alright, Metal Energy, Herdio, Spirit Mask, Pal Dude, Pet Lil, Pika Boy, Pump Kaboo, Emolga, Rubat, Elemental Badge for our reverse, 
and Grandpa the Grandpa with what can only be described as one hell of an awesome psychedelic artwork. I love that. How awesome. Shame it's not a hollow or a V card or anything similar. Last pack for today's opening guys to celebrate the the drop day of Evolving Skies if that's what you want to call it. Sadly here in the UK Elite Trainer Boxes have been delayed until possibly the end of September due to them not being able to get them into the country quick enough. Ain't that something? Psychic Energy, Stormy Mountains, Boulder, Shkiplum with the hop hip to go with it. We got a Swablu, Cryogonal, Zora, Petlil. Cue to fly and <gasps> ah, I mean, very cool looking card, Noivern V, and uh, you know, Dragon type, quite powerful in the game, from what I've been told. I know um one of the uh, a person that I thought had one of these, and it was quite a pain in la derrière. <laughs> that is about all we've got time for today for this. Evolving Sky Celebratory opening uh, to Mark. Obviously, today being Friday the 27th of August, the day that Evolving Skies came to us all officially before, you know, uh, other than the build and battle boxes, which were about a week or two ago. One every five packs for a shiny or a V card. Not sure if that's good or not. It is what it is. That's what I always say. It is potluck when you open up these packs of cards, and I'd once again like to thank whatscards.co.uk for, you know, helping me get this booster box. Looking forward to opening the rest of the box. Obviously, we haven't pulled the secret rare V Maxes or anything like that in that, it, which means there's still hopefully at least a, a V Max or two in there, some full arts, etc. So we'll get there in one of the next videos coming up during September, guys. Thank you very much for joining me. Please do hit that thumbs up button. Click that subscribe button, and until next time, stay well, stay safe.